Hey, how's it going, everybody? Welcome back to another video. I wanted to just make a quick one because I've been kind of playing Assassin's Creed Origins a little bit more lately, and uh, I haven't done the gift of gods, gift from the gods, and uh, it's Final Fantasy 15 crossover. So if you don't know how to do it, here we go. The fireball has revealed an entrance to this tomb. This is a sign from the gods. So obviously you're going to want to go into the front of the gate here. You're going to want to go up to it. You're going to see the XV, Roman numeral for 15, and uh, a sundial picture. Could this be referring to a sundial? I wonder. And, uh, yes it is, bike. This number seems important. Alright, so we're going to want to go outside again. It's really close to sundial. It's just right across if you just want to follow me in real time here. And... Um, I'm just gonna, I just go up to the top there just to show you a top-down view of it. But what you're gonna want to do when it's required, or you don't have to have it, it's the ability to change the time of day, or you can just wait until the uh, mid-morning kind of, it's like morning kind of afternoon time. Uh, so it took me like, what, two times I had to go, go to night and then go back to day, and then after that we were there. So once you've opened these pillars, you're going to want to shoot the middle one here three times, as you see on screen. And after that, immediately go back to the gate, and it's open. And this will be the end of the video, so if you want to click off now and not spoil the side quests, uh, do so, because... I don't know, maybe you want to check it out yourself, you don't want to see it on the video here, so go ahead and do that. Or just stick around because I'm going to show the entire cutscene here. Pretty freaking cool, I'm not going to lie. Make sure to like rating, enter subscribe, and I will see you in the next one.